I'm making my first stew with my new 12 volt uh, Road Pro here. I've got taters in the bottom and obviously carrots and and big chunks of roast. Biggest thing I'm concerned about is it's so small. I wanted to fit more, a lot more in there because I got a lot more, but it is what it is. And I'm going to use uh, these beef bullion cubes here and uh, put them in the boiling water. And then I'm going to add it to this and I'm going to let it all cook for like six hours. Woo! Now I've got the beef broth in there. It was boiling. Um, I'm going to stir this around a little bit. And I just turned the slow cooker on. I don't... There's something I'm not sure about. <clears throat> I've seen people cook the meat before they put it in the slow cooker. And I've seen some people not do it. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> but... I did not cook the meat. I would figure that if it's cooking for six hours, that that would cook the meat. So, yeah. It's on, and I'll see you guys in six hours. We'll see what happens. It's been a beautiful day today. And it is now six hours later. I looked it up, and you can actually put uh, raw meat in a slow cooker and it'll be plenty cooked but it's nice to sear it first before you do this because it gives you better flavor so let me dish up all right check it out let me give this a try hot 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 Mm. The meat is really tender, but it's kind of dry to be honest. Everything is great, but a little dry. I think this would have been better if I made it, well, first, if I seared everything on the stovetop, um, it would have taken out some of the fat, too. And also, if I would have cooked this in some sort of gravy instead of, uh, yeah, the beef broth. All right. I think I'm actually going to put some ranch dressing on this. <laughs> I got lots of other things I'm going to cook up in this. Mm. Lots of other things. I'll be showing you guys. All right, day two. It is, <clears throat> I don't know, about nine in the morning. And uh, I'm learning how to make my stew better. I'm browning this meat and the veggies first before I put it in there. I don't need to, but it's probably going to be more full of flavor if I do. I also, I think I want to do some sort of gravy instead of the beef broth. I don't know. We'll see. All right. I'm just, uh... I've got a worship video, praise the Lord, that I'm playing right now while I'm cutting all this, while I'm cutting all this stuff up. I've got everything browned in here. I don't really, I have one package of brown gravy, and that wouldn't really be enough. So, well, I mean, I suppose it could be, but I guess I'm just going to go with beef broth again. For now, it is what it is. <laughs> All right. Good morning, folks. Actually, it's not even the morning. It's more like noon. And I'm making some pancakes. Oh, there ain't no rules. You can have pancakes for dinner if you wanted. 
But that's probably going to be my dinner right there, mixed with spaghetti. All right, folks, I made myself a big breakfast. And trying to get this syrup out. Hoping that I don't have to open another bottle of syrup. Come on now. Slow as syrup. <laughs> oh yeah. That'll be enough. I just put syrup on everything. Alright guys, it's like four days later. 